Hey there, my name is Jessica and welcome to The Just Tales. Today's video is going to be all about my experience with the Braun IPL device. I did so much research before I decided on the Braun IPL device over others. I felt like there was a lack of reviews that showed the true results of the Braun device whenever I was doing my research, so I promised myself if I ended up loving it, I would definitely do a full review, so here it is. I figured if you're watching this, you've probably already done your research on what IPL is, so I'm not going to bore you with those details. If you want to look more into it, just Google IPL or Google Braun IPL or Intense Pulse Light, and you'll find everything you need to know there. But this is just purely my experience with it, and spoiler alert, I'm obsessed. This video is 100% unsponsored. I wish it was sponsored, but they did not send me the device. I did all my own research and I was the one who chose to go with the Braun IPL. So the main reason why I wanted IPL, it was not for my legs at all. This was for my bikini line and my armpits. I'm just gonna give you a forewarning. This video is gonna be pretty TMI because these are the details that I needed to know, so I'm just going to share them with you. So I did a full Brazilian with this IPL device, and I'm so happy with it. I used to get Brazilian waxes, and I stopped getting them because first of all, super painful, second of all, very expensive, and you have to like let your hair grow out a lot in order to get a good result from a wax. And that's just not okay with me. I don't like that. For the coarse hair that you have under your armpits and your bikini area, it's just so uncomfortable to shave. And I was just, I was not comfortable. It was terrible. So with laser, you may have to go back. I've heard of stories of people who got laser hair removal. They had a kid and then because of all the hormone changes as a female, they ended up having to get laser again. And I didn't want to go through that. It was way too expensive. I started signing up for like appointments to have a consultation done. It was just going to be thousands of dollars for laser hair removal. And I just don't really want to spend that much money. I mean, I think it's a great luxury, but I didn't want to do that. What I love about the IPL device is if you get a good one like this Braun device is, it's a few hundred bucks, but it's yours for life. You have to look at like the pulse life, how many light flashes that device has, I believe is how you would say that. But basically Braun was one of the highest, meaning that it would last the longest. It had a longer lifespan of pulses, of light pulses than any other brand did. So that means that if any hormonal changes happen or if I need to touch up, it's mine. It's a lot more work. I think it takes longer to work versus laser, but that's okay with me because you're saving hundreds, if not thousands of dollars. And so that was worth it for me. So I wanted to answer one more question and then I'm going to do my little tutorial on how to do it and show you the device. But um, is it painful? Well... The first time I ever used it, I was so nervous. I don't know why. I am not good at self-inflicting pain. I heard someone say on a blog post on a review that it was like taking a rubber band and wrapping it around a car and then driving a mile with that car and then the car letting the rubber band go and that snapping you <laughs> from a mile away. Um, and that was just not a pretty picture. It is not that bad. I have never had to turn the gentle thing down at all. The first time I used it, I freaked out and I was just going to test it on my armpit and I stood in the bathroom. I am not kidding, probably about 10 or 15 minutes before I actually did the first little shoot of the light because I was so freaked out thinking it was gonna be painful and it was not that bad. I will say it's probably worse when you first start because you're shocked and you don't really know what to expect, um, but it's really not that bad. So I thought that I was using it on the most gentle setting because the way that it works, and I'll show you a video of it, but you press the little gentle feather button, three lights I thought meant the most gentle but three lights actually means the least gentle, so like full force. I had it backwards the first time I used it and I was freaked out thinking, oh my gosh, I've already used it on the most gentle setting and it was uncomfortable. Like I'm not gonna be able to do it full force. Turns out I was using it full force the entire time. They do recommend that you start it off on a more gentle cycle, so definitely watch my video on how to work the gentle settings because that will help you out so much. But no, it was not painful. And the results are amazing. I do not have armpit hair anymore. You know how whenever you shave your armpits and then you have in your bikini line, like this is really bad wearing a bathing suit. If you shave, then you have like those little dots and you can see the hair follicles. So it really doesn't look like you shaved at all. It looks like you have a constant five o'clock shadow. 
that's what my everything looks like my legs and everything after I shaved and it disappeared like it looks like I've never grown hair under my armpit at all I will say the only thing about this versus laser I'm not really sure if laser does this as well but with IPL you're not gonna get those fine little peach fuzz hairs and so if I don't shave my legs for a week or two I will start to feel fuzzy and I do have like a little bit of peach fuzz but it looks like the rest of my arm does like little tiny peach fuzz hairs that grow on your arm you'll get that like on your armpit because the light doesn't actually attract those hairs because they're too light and too fine that's not a big deal as long as you don't see the dark armpit hairs that i used to have i'm so good with that so let's back up just two seconds my armpits and my bikini line for brazilian is what i wanted to do those areas are the reason why i bought this device and after using it there for like two weeks I was already seeing results and I decided to just do my legs because why not? So I started doing my legs and now I've done like all of my legs and I only grow hair in like two or three little patches on my legs that I've occasionally missed from the IPL device, but it works surprisingly well on my legs. I think it works faster and better on my legs than it did my underarms in my bikini area, which I thought it would be the opposite. The hairs on my legs aren't as dark there, but surprisingly it worked better on my legs. So here is a photo for reference. This photo is a close-up of each armpit. December 5th, took this photo right before I was about to use it for the first time. And this was like one week post shave on my armpit. So this is how much hair I grow on my armpit and they grow fast and they are thick. So excuse that, but that's what that looks like. What I did is I actually did a Braun IPL tracker on my phone. And so this way I kept track of what date I was doing this IPL device on my bikini, underarms, and then my legs. Like on Monday, I would do bikini and underarms, and that would take me like five minutes. It's so quick and so easy. On like Thursday or Friday or at the end of the week, I would do my legs in a whole nother session. So like twice a week, I was using this device. You only want to use it per body part once a week. I took notes, and on week four, I was already super patchy, only two times to start seeing patchiness. So I was already seeing results after two weeks and then after four, I was super patchy. On week 10, I had one hair left under each armpit and then week 16, I had one hair left on my right armpit, which is this one, and that's it. So that's like kind of where I left off. I still have a little bit of hair in a very specific spot for my Brazilian area and it's been 17 weeks so it's about four months of consistent weekly use so honestly i would have thought i would have seen better results than that i'll probably take a break like all through the summer when i start laying out more because you don't want to expose your skin to too much sun or any sun when you're going through the IPL and you also don't want to tan and then do it because it doesn't work as well with a tan so i'm probably going to start pausing um, and not do this again till next fall or winter if I have to. So it'll be interesting to see how much I have to do in the fall and winter. The fact that it's optional for me to shave anything at this point on a bi-weekly basis is amazing. So I will take that. And then for my legs, I've only done 13 weeks. Um, I didn't really take any notes on this, but you'll see it in the video. And I filmed the video, I think, at, um, week 12. I haven't done quite as much. I'm about a month behind on my legs, um, but I've already, like, you'll see I've seen great results. So next, I'm just going to show you exactly what my routine is and how I do my legs, how it works. I'm going to show you the device, and then I'm also going to show you what my armpits look like currently, close and personal. Okay, so I'll show you my armpits. The last time that I shaved my armpits was eight days ago. I haven't done anything to them since. I'm trying to get good lighting, but this is what it looks like. There's like a few light, light hairs, um, but not a lot and they're super, super soft. They're very, very thin, it's like peach fuzz, but I don't have like that pore look where you can like see dark pores. This is the other one. So again, I have like a super, super light one over there, um, but I don't have like all those pore bumps. They're just completely smooth. It has been so amazing. So I have to worry about shaving my armpits anymore. I'm trying to show you my leg as best I can in the lighting. You can see how patchy it is. And like here's hairs right here. I don't even know if you can see it in the camera. A little patchy like right up here, but that's it. Like that's all the hair on my legs and it's been a week. Okay, so this is the device and just a really quick walkthrough. 
um, this is what it looks like and then you have to add a little head to it I always use the regular size head but it also comes with a smaller head to get like harder to reach areas like around the knees if you wanted to pop the head on and you just press a button you'll hear it come on so it like kind of has like a fan inside of it this is the gentle button and you can press it to make it uh, gentle and then more gentle like that's the most gentle when it's one light I have never had to use it on gentle I always use it on full force and then you can either like click this or like hold it down it'll continuously go so I'm just going to start doing it and I'm gonna film myself doing my armpits and my legs so you can see how fast it takes I have to look in the mirror so So you can see how when you hold it up to your skin and it's not like all the way on, it'll turn like red when I'm trying to do it, um, the little bars, and then it lights up so it's like adjusting to the sensitivity of depending on like your skin color and where it is. I'm gonna do this one. So my armpits are done. There's like absolutely no redness. It does not hurt me. I mean, there are some spots that are very sensitive, but it doesn't like hurt. And then I'm gonna do my legs and the worst part is the inner thigh that kills. It is so sensitive there, but I'm just gonna do it on my legs. I hold down the trigger so it continuously goes instead of how I did on my armpits where I like pressed for each pulse. I do my knees one pulse at a time. So that was exactly 10 minutes to do my armpits and one leg. Um, actually, it was a little less than that because I filmed, so I'll have to figure out how many minutes, but I'm pretty sure it was exactly like five to seven minutes to do both armpits and one whole leg. So I'm going to do the other leg and then I'll be done. turn it off you just hold down the gentle button for like three seconds and you're done so you have to let it cool and then you kind of have to like wipe out the inside you can like see a little crisped <laughs> like smoke spots from the hair I am editing this video right now and I didn't really get a chance to tell you exactly how long it took so I wanted to show you that this entire clip that I filmed from beginning of armpits all the way through to both legs, including me talking through it, was exactly 14.9 minutes, and that includes the ending part as well. So about a little less than, I think, 13 or 12 minutes for armpits and both legs. So that was everything. That is my full review of the Braun IPL device. I hope that you found this helpful. I know there were quite a few of you that were very interested in seeing this from my Instagram, which if you don't follow me there, definitely go check that out. Um, and I shared that I was having really good results and a few of you purchased it. And so I hope that you're having good results, but I hope this video helps and keeps you motivated. I will say it takes a good amount of commitment, but it is so easy literally five minutes for the armpits and bikini line and then 10 or 15 minutes for my legs and i was done that's all it took each week so i hope that you've loved it i will link the device down below in the description box please subscribe if you have not already and i will see you next week mm -hmm.